guys welcome back to another video on my channel and so today I'm just gonna be showing you how to create this neutral everyday daytime glam that I wear it's basically just my go-to look I wear this to work school and yeah basically anytime it's my favorite thing to do it doesn't take real long eventually you get faster with it too with that being said I'll have all my products and brushes and everything linked down below and let's get started into the video so i've already done my eyebrows off camera using my anastasia beverly hills dip brow pomade in the shade dark brown and also use my <laughs> my tarte shade tape concealer in fair neutral so the next thing i'm going to do is my eyelashes i like to do them first before the rest of my face just so it's a little bit easier for me and so the first thing i'm going to be using is the nyx big and loud lash primer and just coating all of my lashes with this and then after that I'll be using my NYX double stacked mascara Next, to prime my face, I'll be using the Mario Badescu Facial Spray with Aloe, Herbs, and Rose Water. And for foundation today, <laughs> we're using the Makeup Forever Ultra HD Stick. I'm in the shade 117Y225. Then to buff that out, I'll be using my Mikasa Beauty f200 brush i do have a coupon code i will link that down below in the description and then for my forehead i like to use a beauty blender for concealer i'm using the same concealer i used on my eyebrows so the tarte shape tape again in fair neutral Then to set my face, I'll be using the Airspun Loose Face Powder. I don't personally like to bake just because I feel like it doesn't work well with my skin. So I'm just going to be lightly dusting this on. And this brush is some random brush I got in a kit from Sephora, so it doesn't have a name. To contour my face, I'll be using my Too Faced Cocoa Contour Kit. I'm using the shade Medium Cocoa. My palette's a mess, so excuse that, but that shade. And again, this is a brush I got in a Sephora kit, so it doesn't really have a name or anything. Then underneath that, to cut my contour, I'll be using the shade Light Cocoa with a little mini beauty blender. For blush, I'll be using my favorite blush, which is the Urban Decay Afterglow 8 Hour Powder Blush in the shade Video. I like this one because it's a really neutral color. You can really do a lot with it. It's not too heavy because I'm not a big fan of like real pinkish or real reddish blushes. So this one's just right because it's very, you know, neutral. Now for my favorite part, which is highlighting, I'll be using my, this is also for a brush. There's no name on it. And my, um... Makeup Revolution Vivid Baked Highlighter in the shade Golden Lights. Okay. 
So I'm gonna be that. Then what I'm gonna be doing is just spritzing the brush after I've dipped it in some highlighter with some Fix Plus by Mac. And just going over top. Then also highlighting my Cupid's bow. The tip of my nose. And then the bridge of my nose. And my forehead. And then of course you can't forget your eyebrows. This this brush is from uh, BH Cosmetics. It has no number or name, so sorry about that. Then for my inner corner highlight, I'll be using this Mirabella Glitter Glaze highlighter. Looks like this, the shimmery gold. And again, I'm using a BH Cosmetics brush. Brush. I'm pretty sure this one is the just called a pencil brush. Then for my lips, I will first be lining them with this Smashbox Always Sharp Lip Liner in the shade Crimson. Then on top of that for lipstick, I'll be using my Tarte Lip Sculptor in the shade Harlequin. Then lastly what I like to do is, I just like to go back in with my mascara and my uh, dip brow pomade just to make sure they're extra dark. Also for eyebrows, I use the Mikasa E100 brush, just to let you guys know. Then finally to set my face, I'll be face face. <laughs> I'll be using the Urban Decay Chill Makeup Setting Spray. Then following that, I just like to go back in with highlighter, just to make it extra glowy. Alright, so that concludes this video on my everyday makeup look. Hope you guys enjoyed watching. Be sure to comment, like, subscribe. And don't forget, I'm doing a giveaway once I hit 1,000 subscribers. So everyone that subscribed will automatically be entered. So be sure to do that. And I hope you guys enjoyed watching. Bye!